Good morning. It is five minutes past 11. It is Friday the 27th of September. I have tea and it's time for today in my boo journal. How are you? Everything all right? I had some happy mail yesterday. I had, um, what did I have? I had some, I had a retractable straw because they're making all the straws here in the UK paper now as a in a effort to cut down on the plastic pollution issue that's going on and it's so cool because it comes with its own little telescopic cleaning brush i mean look at just look at it how freaking cute is that you know that is just adorable um and that fits inside the straw quite nicely for transport and then you just you know i assume you slurp through the rubbery dungy end so yeah it's nice it goes all in there quite nicely got to wiggle it to get it into there and then you just literally just and it's got a keyring so you can just attach it to your keys because everybody's always got their keys with them and that was it I got it off of AliExpress I got me one I got Cali one and then I had these, which is probably going to make Amber a bit jealous. These are vintage camera stickers. Look at the stickers. What the stickers? Shall I open them? Right. Ugh. Oh, these are large. You know, I haven't actually opened these Amber because I thought I would do them online. Some of them are small and then some are a little bit bigger. That one's quite good because it's quite big because it's got extra little bits like the film case and all of that lot. These are nice. Oh, they've actually got like little digital screens and all that lot. Oh, these are so cool. I can see me using these loads. I'm going to have to find my little drawer set in a minute so I can put them away. What's that? Polaroid close-up. Oh, these are nice. I like these. Yeah, I like these a lot. That's that one. <laughs> yeah, these are really cool. So I shall put these away in a little box thing in a moment. I need to tidy my um, my other table up. I've got a sewing table next to me. And that's what I had my little boxes of ephemera on and then I moved it because I was doing all the tea dyeing and, and the, the table I can do the tin that I do the tea dyeing in and then 12 sheets of paper so I moved everything off of the table and then I went down and I sorted some Stuart stuff out and when I came home I just dumped it all on the table and uh, yeah the table's now full of shit so yeah so yeah, that's what I had arrive yesterday. Oh, and, 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 I got a postcard. The Hawkeye State, Iowa, from Tita. Thank you, darling. I am glad that you enjoy my channel and my vlogs. I really appreciate it. And I love the flower stamp, excuse me, it's a poinsettia on the on the stamp, which I love. And thank you. And she lives in a small town with only 952 people in it. That's awesome. I would love to live somewhere like that, but that's only okay if you get on with everybody. If you don't get on with everybody, then it's shit, isn't it? And you're like, oh shit, fuck. So date of statehood was december 28 1846 i love information postcards like this it's great capital city is is i'm not going to try and pronounce that is it De, des mois des moines and I'm, I'm never 100 percent sure and iowa has 3,134,693 the state bird is the eastern goldfinch and the flower is the wild prairie rose and this is iowa i'm talking about here And she's very kindly marked on it where she lives or near you know town nearest where she lives which is fab 
That's great. I love these kind of postcards. They are really awesome. It's even got like the, the great seal of the state of Iowa on it and a flag. That's brilliant. Love it. Thank you, darling. That's going in my journal a bit later on. I'm going to, as soon as I've got a gap, <laughs> because I'm just, it came yesterday. So there's a very, very good chance that it will go in. I'll probably stick it here. Yeah, so I just need to pull out some. Probably use my map tape. <clears throat> it's been a while actually since I've had a postcard because I haven't done my post crossings one. And the last one I got was this one. And that was a post crossings one. Um, and I stuck it in, so yeah. Okay, right, let's get on and stop waffling because I've got things to do. So yesterday I didn't wear makeup. I did the challenge because it was sweet potatoes, wasn't it? There was no booze. It was one can or less. There was chips. Did I cough? No. Batch day, did I do a batch day? No. Garden. I've just had more post arrive. I wonder what it is. And I did my night care. My son and I had Chinese food last night. And I'm such a whore for Chinese food that I save half of it and have it the next night again as well. I'm gonna go see what that post is and see if there's anything exciting. It doesn't look very exciting. It's brown. Right, so yes, we had Chinese food last night, which was lush. Really, really nice. Okay, I love Chinese food. If you don't love Chinese food then you're wrong. Um, okay so my black pen's gone there it is. So yesterday I would say my, my mood was okay. I was in a good mood all day. We had Chinese food. Mm, yeah I was quite achy because I did a lot in the way of steps so you know there you go, 21,783. We ended up leaving the kitchen in a complete mess of Chinese tubs all over the place. We did do fuck all. We literally ate Chinese and watched wrestling. It was great. <laughs> so, so, yeah. Um, I need to I need to get on and get some stuff done I realize this but you know what it was just like I don't give a shit yesterday and I really didn't so I paid Sarah I paid Mrs Lee and I paid Joff having Daryl the other day um, why didn't I cross those off on Wednesday anyway, whatever. and that's it we're all caught up right let's move that stuff not crossed off properly it's just not right okay what did I do with the pen I just pulled out oh. <laughs> I couldn't see it <laughs> if I'd looked up I'd have seen it right day face cream is on I don't feel like filling the card today I have a headache so I'm taking a break from that today I was supposed to go and um, see Stuart's mum today and do a little bit more sorting but the weather is sunny one minute and then pissing it down the next and the up and downness of it has given me a god awful headache so um and i'm really really tired so i'm just having a day at home today and get to bed till half past midnight and i remember the days when that wasn't late <laughs> but it is now and uh and i'm tired so I phoned her up and sort of checked in with her and found out she was. I said I'd be down on Monday. Yeah, lovely day of stay. I spent most of it with my mum, which was really good. We went out, we ordered the rest of the bits needed for the fence, which is mortifying actually because it's costing so fucking much just to put in a new fence. As we're replacing the border fence between me and my neighbour as well 
not there's any you know it's i say there's nothing wrong with it it's wobbly and it was done very crappily by a local handyman the, actually the one who let me down for putting my outside tap in the other week um yeah and it's it's you know it's not very good um, which is why she wanted to get professional in this time because she knows that once it's in it, it'll be all right because I will take care of it whereas my sister who used to live here didn't so um yeah we've <coughs> excuse me spent a lot of money on this fence so far and it's not even been fucking installed yet And it's probably going to cost us about as much to install it as it did to buy the fucking stuff. And I'm just, I'm a bit like, mm, about the whole thing at the moment. Oh, I've got to put some laundry on. I've got to do that in a sec, so I'll mark that off. No, I was going to do it. Yeah, I'll go and get it. And then I put Daryl's uniform in when he comes home. Yeah. Right. Friday. I've got to set up the races for anybody who wants them. I'm gonna stop here because I can smell my lunch so my lunch must be ready and I'm quite frankly starving to death um, yeah I spent the whole day with my mum yesterday we went and we bought all the new fence bits and then we went home and we ate lunch together at the kitchen table it was really nice so yeah I'm stopping there because my lunch is and I'm actually my stomach's trying to escape so I need to go eat I will catch you all a little bit later have a good day Welcome back. It is 10.40 p.m. I did not mean to stay up this late. I am beyond tired. I'm absolutely cream hackered. Um, I know that I stopped like rather abruptly earlier on, but you know, my lunch was ready and I was hungry. And I've just edited the morning bit and I can't remember what I've done now, so. <sighs> this, yeah. I'm going to need that because I'm pretty sure I haven't done the numbers. Right. Let's just go through it bit by bit. Right, so I wore day face cream. I did not wear makeup. I need to do the challenges. I have not had booze. I had less than one can. I've not had chips. I've not crafted. I will do about today in a minute. And the garden again has been well and truly soaked this evening due to the rain. My mood is holding steady. My pain is up though because I've done a lot of stepping, which you'll see in the morning. I can tell you that I will be colouring in the chart tonight because I've gone way over what is on the chart. So yeah, I have, I'm in loads of pain. That's what I'm gonna do in a little while. Take a painkiller. I'm gonna put my hot blanket on. Oh, this is uploading. And then by the time this is uploaded and edited and ready to go, bed will feel lovely. I'm already at 27,500 steps. Bang on. So, might as well fill that bed in. I won't be doing anything tomorrow because I plan on basically having a very nice relaxing day. I'm Well, I say relaxing. I'm going to um, get in here and tidy up a little bit so that I can... Um, finish my junk journal cover I mean I'm calling it a junk journal but I don't know whether I'll actually do it like a junk journal and that's why I hummed and hard so much about it because I just didn't know whether it, it's really me I like the idea of it but I don't I don't put that much stuff in it you know well it has rained all fucking day it has been so so interchangeable Literally, you'd be sat there, and then all of a sudden, you would look up, and it would be pelting down. Of course, we all got wet during the school run. I didn't go and see um, Stuart's mum today. 
which I was planning on doing mainly because I had such a bad headache and um, I just I did not fancy getting soaked I mean I saw Michelle shelf and she said you know she had like waterproofs and she said she's had them ages and she said I don't care if I look silly at least I'm dry and I'm like you know what I might get myself a pair you know a pair of waterproof trousers and a waterproof coat Right, that seems to be it. I think I'm all caught up, yeah? Did I, oh, did, did I look at the drawers? Friday. I have done the, I've done the laundry and the dishwasher is, has been on. I actually couldn't tell you what I've done all day. I've sort of just been pottering about, really. Anyway, that's it. I want to get this done so that I can go to bed because it's now 5 to 11 I'm exhausted. Um, okay, thank you so so much for joining me as per usual. Um, I am going to go and get this edited, get it uploaded, and go and crash out for the night. My autofocus is on. I apologise, my computer restarted. I really hope it's not been bad for the second part of this video. I apologise about that. I forgot to restart the software to turn it off bugger sorry um thank you so much for joining me today please feel free to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to leave us a comment down below because we love the comments and the kisses you know that we do if you click the book here down in the bottom corner you will be subscribed and then there's a bell down there somewhere if you click that as well <laughs> and youtube's working um you'll be notified when i upload new content i hope you have a fantastic rest of your day and i will see you in saturday's edition of today in my boo journal Take it easy, guys.